Hey, my name is Niranjan Pradhan and welcome to this video in which I will show you side by side how the features in the front end offer and the front end plus OTO one offer look in Android Mazes. All right. This is a question that I asked in our Facebook group and many of our customers believe that creating such a video would be very helpful for them to understand how the features fit against each other. All right. So this video is created because of that purpose and I really hope you get an idea and understand what is included in each version. Now let me tell you that when the launch happens, it will be released as a funnel that basically means you will get a front end offer with certain level of, uh, you know, uh, certain features associated with it and then you can make a decision whether or not those features are relevant to you. Only when you make a purchase of the front end offer, you will be uh, you'll be uh, able to see the sales page for the first upgrade and so on, right? Just to let you know, just to clarify everything, only when you purchase the front end offer will you be able to get inside of the funnel. Otherwise, you'll not be able to get inside of the funnel and anything else you purchase after the front end offer is optional for you, okay? If you believe it is delivering a ton of value to your business, which I'm sure you will, go ahead and purchase it. Else, you can always skip that offer and keep moving forward. All right, so let's get started. Now, what I've done is for the purpose of demonstration, which is where like, you know, I received a lot of compliments from you that comparing the features against an actual account would be helpful in making your decision, making your buying decisions. All right. So for that particular purpose, what I have done is I've created an account here, as you can see this one. And uh, I believe you're able to see that this is in my Safari browser. And this one has access only to the front end product, as you can see here. Okay. At the same time, what I've done is I have created another account and this one is in Chrome. This one has access to front-end and OT1 offers. All right. So I'll be able to show you the differences by shuffling between these two browsers and showing you exactly what is going on. So let me quickly go to the default collection. And here, what we will do is instead of going to the default collection, we will actually delete the default collection. This is where we have OT1 available and we will create another collection here all right so what we'll do is we'll name the collection as if you plus oto one let me see if the application takes it right so that way that way we'll be able to actually see this if you plus oto one here and it'll be easy for us to uh, kind of you know work with this you know what i think it will be easier or better look more professional if we just call it fe okay so now we have got fe in in the safari browser and the FE plus OTO one access in the Chrome browser. All right, so let's get started by reviewing the features one by one. You must have already seen the front end video and the OTO one video. You must have had a lot of questions answered that, that you may have in mind answered. If you have any other questions, I, I have a strong feeling those will be answered in here because what I'm going to do is I have listed down all of these features from front end and OTO one. I am going to run through those features. I'm not going to go through each one of them rather what I'll do is I'll focus on presenting the differences between the front end and the OTO one in this video and show you how it works out. Okay. So wherever there is a difference, I'm going to mark it red, wherever like, you know, the features are pretty much, uh, you know, uh, same in if both the accounts, I'll leave it at that. All right. So 150 premium hand drawn maze templates. This is a part of FE. All right. You just get 150 uh, premium templates. You have already seen that yesterday. I'm not going to get into it. Right. Intuitive point and click dashboard, easy handling of mazes. This again, we have discussed. It's a part of FE. Choose from multiple trim sizes based on your book needs. Again, this is available in FE. Multiple page numbering styles for enhanced flexibility in page design. Again, this remains consistent. Show and hide page margins. This is there in FE. Five unique hand-drawn maze styles to give you the ultimate design experience. So just so you know, there are five different styles. We have got four here right now because the fifth one is in the process of being uploaded as I'm creating this video. All right. So there'll be a total of five and each one will have about 30 unique mazes in them, making it a total of 150 premium hand on elements. Okay. Just that is worth the value, like, you know, worth the investment that you make in this application, by the way, one click solution path picker. You've already seen that this will be, uh, you know, this will be something that we would be interested in taking a look at because this is where OTO one would have some features that would be additional. Okay. Now let me show you what I mean by this. Okay. One click solution path picker. This is basically referring to this particular option here where if you have, if there are potentially more than one solution paths, 
you can pick the one you want to like i mean you know you like for your maze okay so uh, that's what we are talking about right so mazes with multiple solution paths for advanced flexibility this is there in like you know out of those five styles you may have one or more, one or more which have uh, solution paths that have uh, you know multiple solution paths basically for every maze right smart solution connect technology automatically creates and connects solutions on these pages right so this is basically us talking about the solution page and how uh, you know it, it it works like magic basically you insert a page you delete a page and the solution page takes care of itself okay smart solution connect okay we discussed this show and hide mazes option makes it super simple to preview solution to active on active page this is something that we have discussed in the front end video as well one click maze transparency this is available in the front end it is already discussed in the front end uh, video easy image upload functionality again a part of the front end offer M multiple solutions multiple solution page layouts again it's a front end feature which is al already discussed add titles descriptions and instructions using the super flexible drag and drop text editor right now this again is a front end offer that we have already discussed in the front end video 900 fonts already discussed customized font color from the provided palette and this is where i believe we have some featured based segregation between the front end and the uti one offer so let me show you how it looks how this particular thing looks in an account which just has front end access versus an account where we have front end as well as uti one access okay so this one here is just the front end one all right and what i'll do is i'll, I'll insert some text and this dummy text what i'll do is i'll try to change the color as you can see this particular palette gives me limited colors okay i have about um you know about 16 different colors that i can choose from okay whereas if i go here this is basically front end plus oto1 what happens is um let me introduce the text box if you click here you will see that the entire palette is available for you so you have unlimited colors here you can go for any shade that you want you can look for any transparency that you want and you'll be able to kind of you know change the color here you can enter your hex code as well if you like and this color will be changed all right so this is the difference that i wanted to showcase between the front end and the ot1 offer when it comes to customization of font font color from the provided palette so here you work with the provided palette in the uh, front end which is about 16 images uh, sorry which is about 16 colors and the same thing when you move to ot1 you would have unlimited color and this is where this is where we talk about that unlimited font color all right by the way when you see the sales pages these are the features you'll be seeing in there all right so i really hope this video gives you a clear idea of what we are doing and like you know what each one of these features mean to you and your business okay download a single hand-drawn maze or a whole book of hand-drawn mazes in one click you can do this in ot1 as well so there's nothing different here download files in multiple formats including pdf png and jpg all right now this is where another differentiation comes in because you are able to download the files as pdf png and jpg let me show you how okay so if you go here you see that this pdf is highlighted when i go there right it becomes purple that basically means it's working this one is working as png as jpg but if you go to pptx it's not getting highlighted because it is disabled in the front end offer in the front end offer you cannot download a page as pptx or powerpoint file okay now here on the other hand this is the front end plus ot1 offer here if you see i can download any one of these options and pptx is also included and this this is extremely useful because you would ideally want to save your files for future use and for future editing right if you're working at scale on kdp this is a feature that you really do not want to miss and this is a differentiator, a massive differentiator between front end and the first upgrade all right so let's move on let me just highlight the same thing in ot1 as well right so download pptx files right because the pdf png and jpg is anyways uh, covered in front end and since in order to get ot1 you must purchase front end like you know, the front end offer is your gateway to the funnel so by the time you are getting ot1 access you would have already got the ability to work with pdf png and jpg right so this is where pptx files are added all right uh, detailed training included this is common like you know the training included is um you know 
there for all to go through up to 100 downloads a month this is something i'd like to spend a minute on clarifying okay in the front end offer you get 100 downloads or 100 credits per month please note that you are not limited in in the total number of books you can create in a year or in a couple of uh, like you know for example like you know we, we do not say that um, I think I have to take back my word my it was my mistake okay so when I say 100 downloads what that means is you can click on this download any of these buttons 100 times in a month right that doesn't limit you from doing it again let's say you've done it 100 times this month and it's just the 15th of the month you can always go back and kind of you know next you can always come back to the application and the next month you'll be able to get 100 more credits okay now you might be wondering this is one page right this is one page let, let me switch up the solution so that we are very clear about this okay so you, let's imagine this is one page okay if I download it as a PDF right that would count as one single download okay that was count as one single download let's say i have a book which has about 10 pages all right or maybe yeah three pages in this particular case okay so this is a book which has three pages so if i go here and download this entire book right that would count as one credit as well so it does not really matter whether you have one page or 50 pages or 20 pages okay if you download it once that would be one credit that is taken away from the 100 downloads per month option that is available with you and this is a big feature in OTO one where you get unlimited access to download as many books as you want okay so there'll be no limitation whatsoever and this is one of the reasons why our OTO one features are a big hit with our tribe okay so now let's go back to the next feature on the front end a dedicated support team that simply put cares about your success now you know we are committed and we are dedicated to the success of our tribe okay and we, we've got a support team we've got an amazing tribe of about 1400 low content publishers who are there to help each other out okay and we have been creating success stories uh, like you know in this tribe so you'll be in good hands if you uh, you know uh, become a part of this tribe by the way let's go back to OTO one features and start looking at what are the other options that we have that was not mentioned in here okay so maze solution overlay technology for creating maze stories now this is super super critical and this is a huge difference between the front end and the OTO one offer so let's take a look at the front end offer here now if i switch uh, switch this uh, context menu on for the maze you would see that this view path is disabled okay you do not have access i do not have access to this as a front end user only however if i go to the account which has front end and OTO one access and i enable this right i enable this in that case you will see that i have got this view path option enabled what does that mean that basically means i can see more than one paths at the same time on the screen right so this particular maze has three paths and i can overlap them and see them in one place why is it helpful it is going to be helpful for me because then it will become intuitive for me to kind of you know block a particular path or select one of these paths as my solution because if I want to select path number three as my solution, that basically means I want to close or block path number one and two. Now, if I want to do that, I need to be able to see or visualize which one is path one and which one is path two. It can get extremely difficult. Trust me, I'm telling this from experience. It can get extremely difficult to visualize when you have very complex mazes. That's where this feature will be very handy because you know you will not have to visualize anymore because you can see in different color schemes or different color shades what exactly is the solution path that you want to block and you can just put put a blocker over there and be done with it this feature that we talk about right now is something that is not available in the fronted offer and that is available in OTO one offer okay so this one is a difference between both of them so what I have done is I have put it in red QuickBook Creator to speed up production. Now, QuickBook Creator will be creating a separate video about QuickBook Creator because that's a massive feature in itself, all right? So it needs 
probably a complete video of its own. But just to give you an idea, a QuickBook Creator would give you ability to access all the five types of mazes. Remember, we just see here four because the fifth one is being uploaded as I'm creating this video. But it will give you the ability to just define a certain number of pages, let's say 10, and choose the type of mazes that you probably want to pull because these are all maze types, right? So right now we have four and the fifth one is being uploaded and each one of them has about 30 different variations. So if you want to create a base version of the book really quick, what you can do is you can specify the number of pages, select the type of mazes or maze types that you want to work with and then let the software do its magic and come up with 10 pages of a base layout done that, that then you can go ahead and start customizing okay so you could do this individually for sure but this is a time saving feature that we've built in which will be handy for some of you when you are creating your maze books using hand-drawn mazes all right so let's uh, wait for this task to be completed here so that we can move in uh, to the document and see again so now you can see here we have got 10 different maze pages which have been randomly created. Now I can go ahead and insert my mazes, sorry, insert my images and start customizing them one by one. All right. So this is what we are talking about with the QuickBook Creator. Change later line. Okay. Now let me show you the QuickBook Creator here in FE. If you click on this, you will see that you do not get access to this particular panel. You don't get access to this right rather it takes you to the sales page where you can make the purchase because you do not have access to the front end sorry OTO one offer all right now let's go to the next one change letter and line spacing so let me show you what what we mean by that okay so let's introduce a text in the first place you see this so my awesome is now look at this particular feature it allows you to change this right if you go to fe you would not see any such feature here that's not available here. So this is what we mean by change letter and line spacing. Bulk clone maze page layouts. Okay. Now here, as I as we have already done, let me just delete it and let's start again. Okay. So we have got one page, right? Just one page in here, and you can clone this page so that the content, exact content of this, is repeated, and you have got two pages. One was original, and the one, other one has been cloned, right? So this is the only option available here. However, if you have OTO one access, you will let me delete this. Let me start a new page and let me show you the option I'm talking about. This is what we saw in FE, right? You have additional button here, which says bulk clone. Now, when you click on this, you can actually create more than one pages, right? More than one pages. You can clone more than one pages and that's a OTO one feature. All right. Let's go back to this page here and take a look at the next one. Convert your mazes into sellable printables, right? Now here, you do not get access to changing the color options for the mazes. However, when you are working, and this is absolutely fine. This is absolutely fine for KDP interiors, right? But if you really want to stretch it a little further, what you can do is you can actually go ahead and start playing around with the color options that are available for um, for the mazes okay so as you can see these can come in very handy right these can come in very handy if you are looking at uh, like you know toying around with itsy as a business model or for that matter digital products from your own website as a uh, business model okay so that's the feature which we are trying to communicate or share with you um, when we say convert your mazes into sellable printables. Unlimited color choices for mazes, we discussed this, right? We discussed this, okay? Now, what do you mean by global control for maze color and solution color? So let me show you this. Here, if you see, uh, let me delete it and let's look at this option, global settings. If you go to the global settings, you'll see you do not have access to these features. But if you have access to FE and OTO1, and you go to global settings, you will see this particular option pop up. This design may change a bit because I don't like what I see here. So we've got some time. So I might just sit with the team and kind of you know, streamline the design a little more, but you'll be getting an idea of what this is. Now here, instead of going ahead and changing the color of say 10 pages or the mazes in 10 different pages, I could actually define them upfront. Okay. I want my mazes to be, uh, let's say, 
uh, red in color and I want the solution to be green in color okay so this is the definition I have now what will happen is every maze that I insert will have red outline and it will have green solution right you see this and this is the case this is going to be for every single maze that I insert into this particular page okay so let's try this one right so it's taking a bit but as you can see it is red okay so that's the feature that we're talking of and this can actually help you a lot when you are working on something that involves colored mazes okay multiple solution path styles right now let's go here and insert this maze and then see what are the solution styles that we have okay let, let me increase the size of this and let me switch this on right so you see that the style path that we have is style number one it's a solid line in between right it's a solid line correct that's style number one there are maybe around 11 more styles that are not available as a part of the front end offer those features are available as oto1 offer okay so let me show you a few of them we are not going to go through all of them but i'll just give you a quick idea because you might have seen this in the oto1 video already so if you see the style of this particular line is going to change when we select style 2 similarly if i go for style 6 you might find something different right you might find an arrow or something of that sort right so now you get the idea of what we mean by multiple solution path styles global control for solution styles we've seen this as well like you know of course in the front end offer the global option is not applicable at all but if you come here you'll be able to see that you can actually select the style of your choice globally and then everything will be connected to that and by default you will not have to come here and change style individually all right so that's something that you can do that's available as a part of your oto one purchase okay smart solution preview technology allows you to flip through more than one possible solutions this is where um, we are referring to this ability that you have to play around with all of these options okay play around with all of these options and decide which one you want to work with okay and that is what is going to help you a lot okay so that's pretty much it that's the difference video between the front end offer and the oto one i hope i was able to explain the differences between the two and uh, you probably are in a position to make a very informed decision thank you so much for checking this video out go ahead and like like this video and subscribe to this channel i'm new to this so please pardon if there's anything that I've done wrong here. Thank you. Bye.